This weekend in Roanoke, soccer players are using their sport to connect a range of cultures together. 10 News reporter Alexis Davila is working for you to show us how the most popular sport in the world is used to promote unity in the Star City. Swapping out t-shirts for jerseys, dozens of soccer aficionados battle it out on the field on Sunday. The city helped organize the International Soccer Tournament to acknowledge the growing diversity in Roanoke. It's a sport played in nearly every corner of the world, and Elvira Burbick says it can surpass language and cultural barriers. Soccer is played out in the street, played by everybody, rich, poor. 17-year-old Erin Robertson slipped on her cleats to not just play a passion of hers, but to learn from other people. I love it. I learned so much from them, even different playing styles from different cultures. I think it's amazing. Coming from West Africa seven years ago, Ulrich Glele says it's games like these that help families find comfort in their new home. Inclusion of people. You don't want people feeling like they're an outcast. You want people to come together. That's what builds a community. As Afghan refugees settle in Roanoke, Jocelyn Austin says it's time for the community to open their arms and welcome them in. A lot of them come from a lot of trauma and being able to uh, come to a whole community that receives them with welcoming arms so that it gives them the support for them to be able to learn English, English to do better in life and to help us grow this country like our forefathers. That was their goal. In Roanoke, Alexis Davila, 10 News, working for you. You can find a list of other cultural events happening next week over on our website, WSLS.com.